Here I am with Matt Charney, the fastest mouth from the US. If you can listen and really understand everything that Matt says, you're amazing. And we're on the Broadbead stand, so how are you doing, well, Matt? Well, since I'm in Texas, Trevor, I'll try to talk real slow for you all. <laughs> Wonderful. No, no, talk at your normal speed. I will. Because, I, will. because just... I, I would miss it if you didn't. <laughs> so, and as you can see, we've got other people on the Broadbean stand too. So, Matt, what's hot in all of these events that you've been going to? What's, what, have, what has impressed you the most? What's impressed me the most, I actually think, are the fact that we're seeing a mer uh, larger, I guess, picture, not individual product. We're seeing a real disappearance of HR technology, and actually it's a good thing, into enterprise technology. So that is to say that all of the products in the space uh, is a big change, actually seem to be being engineered to serve other verticals and functions and have much more flexibility than just, say, a system of record. And that excites me because it's like we're finally catching up, and I think that you know events like this are a really good iteration that uh, this market's finally caught up with consumer technology. Fantastic. So what have you been writing about yourself, Matt? Uh, so I guess a little bit along those lines, I think that there are a lot of implications uh, right now for things like you know, Facebook getting into the HR technology space and jobs, Microsoft obviously bringing uh, functionality like um, LinkedIn into uh, the messaging environment, uh, rolling out CRMs. So I think that the way that recruiting is done on a daily basis is, is really changing. And I think that recruiters uh, really need to get caught up in terms of technology selection, what's out there on the market. So I've actually been focused primarily on cons B2C marketing and consumer technology and taking some of those trends and bringing them back to this audience. Matt Charney, it's always a pleasure to meet with you and talk with you. Thank you for your valuable time. Thank you for coming to my hemisphere.